everyone. I'm going to show you my Christmas haul. My Christmas sort of. Um, these were in my stocking. They're hair grips. Santa red and white stripe and snowmen. Well, of course, the red and white stripe, I can use them now anyway. Got some lovely, fluffy, cosy socks. Two pairs. One is red and white and one is red white and blue and they are just lovely i love these so much it's so cozy put me pajamas on put those socks on and snuggle up and lots of chocolates and um, by luckily i took them on holiday with us so when we went to scotland and when we went to iceland mini toblerones so they're good white duck and milk chocolate little individual ones so they'd be really good for um you know just not rationing what do you call it um i don't know i can't remember what the word is you know when you when you don't eat so much and you and you just prep it and you set out little bits portion control yeah portion control my absolute favorite chocolate in the whole wide world is cadbury's and i absolutely love cadbury's buttons because you can guarantee they have got the glass and a half full of milk so they are the original Cadbury's flavour and I love them and these are actually treat size bags in here so that is really good again for portion control per bag uh, 76 calories so that's again is really good for portion control even though nobody bought it for that reason <laughs> um, some chocolate coins got to have them in stocking they're very traditional because that's what people use that's um, one of the um, folk tales is that uh, people had dropped gold coins into their stocking um, i got this tile mate and slim combo pack four tiles to find your keys wallet phone anything so i've got to read about it but it looks like you just attach it to things that you lose a lot <laughs> see it ring it find it use the app to ring your tiles and see them on the map double tap your tiles to make your phone ring so that's really good but the tile looks quite quite big to put on my glasses because that's one thing I am always losing so that was a really good buy um I do I am an old fashioned girl I do like my old DVDs I use DVD player in the car in the gramps and around here somewhere I've got a bright pink one there it is there's my crappy <laughs> um not DVD CD player my crappy CD player but I don't care. This is a Dream Boats and Petticoats Diamond Edition. 100 classics, a lifetime of memories. And they go from the 50s, which is, I absolutely love that kind of era. Um, oh, I just can't wait to start listening to this. Um, number 14, CD2, Petunia Clark. Go downtown, things will be great when you're downtown. I love all of them. I love that. Look, CD number one. Number one, Elvis Presley. Love me tender. Love me true. See? Love it, love it, love it, love it. So I'm very happy to get that. I got a couple of books for my um, Peter Rabbit collection. We've got number 20, The Story of a Fierce Bad Rabbit. And number 17, The Tale of the Pie and the Patty Pan. <laughs> So I'm really chuffed to get those. And I'm still working out where I'm going to put my Peter Rabbit collection. I got um, one of the uh, designer um, covered Peter Rabbit books. This is Clean Up This Muck, said Jemima Puddle Duck. And um, these are um, special anniversary British fashion designer collection. So I've got Jemima Puddle Duck. And that's the House of Holland. And it says these five special editions have been published to celebrate the 150th anniversary of Beatrix Potter's book. Each designer has been commissioned to create a bespoke cover and end papers for their chosen book. And I really want to get Orla, Orla, Orla Keeley, the tale of Miss Tiggy Winkle. Orla Keeley, I just love her designs. They're very 70s style. And then I got this. The story of King Arthur and his knights and it is gorgeous bound leather book and it says classic illustrations and a ribbon marker look at it I can't wait to open that and have a look at it 
I love the story of King Arthur. Of course, I live um, near Glastonbury, so I live near where um, it is believed King Arthur um, was, came. And then I got this lovely photo frame of me and my Rebecca, me and my eldest daughter at her wedding. And I got some Beatrix Potter ornaments. So I got this one. This is Peter Rabbit posting a letter in the post box. I'll show you when they're more open. And then I got this one. This is a special um, Christmas anniversary edition. And it's Peter Rabbit holding a snowman's hand. It's Peter Rabbit's got um, a holly leaf in his other hand. And it has got a ribbon, uh, a ribbon, a robin on the snowman's hat, which I love. And the snowman's got ears. And there's also a robin on the letterbox of the other one. I got this book, uh, a Lucy Goosey, a children's book. I also had another photo frame, and these are um, photos of my children. So this is when they were small. This is the middle daughter, Kerry, the youngest daughter, Holly, nephew, Matthew, and my eldest daughter, Rebecca. This is Holly and Kerry. And this is Holly and Kerry. Holly gave me this frame, so I'm going to put a nice picture in there of my other, of um, all three of them together. And I got this. It is Purify Ultimate Mindfulness Pamper. It's got an eye mask, vanilla scented candle, a mug, and some green tea and lemon. Lovely. I got this um, coloring pad as well look at it 50 sheets to colour Ooh, look at them all and actually i thought i could just add stickles and glitter and maybe frame some so we'll see how they come out and this is what i wanted from my husband portable dvd video player i do have one um where is it it's around here somewhere um but mine is as white and you can hear the the thing as it's going around it's a cheaper version you can hear the disc as it's going around. So hopefully this will be okay. You see me open this. This was from my um, uh, family friends who I went to visit on Boxing Day. It is a clock in the shape of a sewing machine using upcycled, recycled materials. Oh, and that's great. I can't wait to put that up. And you also seen these in the previous video. This is an ornament of um a baby in angel's wings how lovely um uh oh, a mirror with a robin on it and a robin ornament because i totally love robins and and my friend with this also gave me a travel travel mug with robins on it and she gave me something else and it's but they're downstairs and i can't remember remember sorry amy but i have shown you this before um I look at the state of my room, guys. <laughs> I still tidy all this up. Um, you did see all of these items as well. Oh, all of these items before in um, a Disney video. I'll just quickly go over them again. I got two Zum Zums <laughs> from A Bug's Life. I got the animator doll collection. Yeah, princess collection. I love them. These are the mini animators. They're so stinking cute. Love them. Um, this purse and his name has completely passed me by. Oh my gosh, who is it? Who is it? Somebody, somebody tell me. <laughs> oh, dearie me, dearie me. And I got two more Disney decorations for the tree. One is Woody and one is Buzz Lightyear. Look. <laughs> so you would have seen these before in a previous video and I um, just love it. I can't believe that they brought me those back from America. I've also got these dummies, these Winnie the Pooh dummies. Winnie and Tigger. This gorgeous, gorgeous 1937 print. Jigsaw puzzle, it's a thousand pieces of Snow White and Seven Dwarfs, my favourite Disney princess. And you also see me open this at my friends. This is a magnetic daily camp calendar by Melissa and Doug for the nursery. And I just wanted to get these out now because I wanted to get my my um my Christmas 
present haul up because I want to get the things out and start like playing around with them. So, oh, it's so wonderful. So I, oh, well, as usual, I'm very spoiled. I'm very spoiled by all of my family. I am very, very lucky. Very, very fortunate. Um, it wasn't always the case. <laughs> it really wasn't always the case. I don't ever remember a good Christmas in my childhood. Good Christmases started when I had my eldest daughter and I made memories for her. So that is my Christmas present haul. Thanks for watching guys. I love you all. Tell me in the um, comments below what was your best present. And honestly, I couldn't tell you what was my bestest present because I just feel really blessed by having all these lovely things and being able to finally sort my room out. <laughs> finally be able to get my craft room sorted out now that all Christmas and everything is over. I haven't played in it yet, have I guys? I haven't even played in it yet. Oh my gosh, do you remember the development of this room? Because <laughs> we had to put the, we had to um, install a false wall there. So I completely have my room done out. So if you haven't seen those videos, um, those vlogs, go and have a look. See, here, I'm going to walk out of here without my glasses now. I went and had my eyes tested before Christmas, so I'm waiting on new glasses. Yep. So that was my lovely, lovely, lovely Christmas haul.